Hi everyone, welcome to Wild Writing in the Time of Corona. Today's the day when we experiment with a different poetic form and we're going to try today on day 427, would you believe, to try the tanker. Now the tanker is related to the haiku and other Japanese forms and it's only five lines of poetry. It's quite um, it's quite different to other forms of poetry in that um, the lines are very precise in terms of the uh, syllables. Um, I read some advice on it which suggested that of the five lines you should think of the first and third as very short lines and the other lines as just short lines. <laughs> um, if you wanted to count the syllables as you do uh, in haiku, and those of you who've done haiku will know that um, that relies on 17 syllables. Um, the first line has five syllables, the second seven, the third five, and the fourth and fifth have seven. And um, often um, haiku and tanka are I often think of them as tiny little windows opening onto a much wider world. Um, and I have to, um, I'm going to read you mine with a, an apology today. <laughs> well, b apology for it for it being maybe a very easy one to write and slightly, um, well, well, not particularly opening window. Although I have done it um, with the National Trust's No Mo May um, campaign um, in mind as um, they're suggesting that if we leave the grass to grow um, for um, all of May, that the birds and the bees will have more access to the seeds so and the pollen. So I think that's quite a good idea. So um, the tanker then, have a go at it. I think it's um, a form of great potential, although I'm very aware that I haven't fulfilled that. But here's mine. And it certainly doesn't have to rhyme, although mine for ease did. Just so you all know, I'm letting all my grass grow, as it's no mo may. I'm a scare mo here to say, let's let the birds and bees play. As I say, I think the, the rhyme on it probably is rather antithetical to the form, but it's just a little, a little poem for the day. Um, and I'll be back in a day or two with uh, an ordinary workshop, which um, is probably a little bit more um, creative than I've been today. But anyway, you take care. And I'll see you in a few days. Bye bye.